What is up guys and welcome to another episode of PNW Project. What is up guys and welcome to another episode of PNW Project. Last time we cleaned up the underbody of the car and it's looking really good. We degreased everything and there's a couple little rust areas that we want to treat. Um, but besides that it's looking good so that's what we're going to be doing today. We'll bust out that POR15 and get to treating. Here's where we left off, left off last time. So those spots right there, that's where we mounted the rear battery. So we want to clean that up and pour 15 it because you can see in some of the areas it's rusting a little bit. So, yep, just want to get everything ready. so much grimy rust right here the rest of it came out pretty good cleaned up those welded areas what you doing now rusted like my car we have a little, couple little dents we want to fix so we'll try this kit out rubber freight special so there's like this dent right here And the gas tank goes on here and needs to seal good, but that's not going to seal nothing. So let me get in there. We'll try it out. So... To the metal prep dude it's dark but we're gonna metal prep it overnight so that the next day we can actually get some paint done So we metal prepped the car so all that's ready for pour 15 and then um, we were thinking we need to order a rebuild kit for this so we just want to make sure 
and see exactly what parts we need because right now it sounds like there's a bunch of sand in here when I turn it. So if you can hear. You think there's any lube in there? I don't know what's in there. So we're just going to pop this top cover off and see what's inside and see what condition everything's in. Da -da -da -da. Are you ready? Yeah. Look, it's good. <laughs> Actually, how did the teeth look? You can tell that there's wear on the teeth. Like if you look in there, here, turn it around. See there? Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, there's a bit. Oh, look at that. That's a missing tooth. You see that? Mm-hmm. That's when we popped the clutch, I think. <laughs> oh, there it is. So one tooth is missing from here. What about these side ones? Hmm? No, there's like no fluid in there. I mean, there's some at the bottom. Maybe it drained out when we had it on its side. Possible. Because my whole floor was leaky. Any other missing teeth? Not that I see. I'm checking this one now. Oh, this one looks like all of them are there. Yeah, these ones are, don't t don't take as much force. That's probably that noise when it's skipping the tooth and it's hitting the other one. The other thing is, if that tooth is missing, it's probably in there somewhere. Mm, good point. It's probably in the oil. It probably fell down in there or something, or. Maybe it's right there. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Part of it at least. Alright guys, so during this week we also had the opportunity to go to a buddy's shop and use his press. Uh, we took advantage of that to actually push in all of the bushings, the polyurethane bushings that we got. So all of those are ready to go. So here's a clip from there. This is our parts store for the 2002. <laughs> Dude, what happened to the 2002? Yeah, so we're here, this, I guess, East Day sale. Tons of parts, like crazy. So we're gonna be picking up some parts, but tons of wheels, tons of parts, five speeds, dips, shocks, everything. There's some, a lot of 2002 goodies, older BMW stuff. Here. <laughs> look at this. Look at all these diffs. 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 Those look like old 2002 ones. See those? This is the long neck. 
Mm -hmm. so, the, so the early style was, I think the 1600s had those. Oh dang dude, there's parts everywhere. D21 low. Trannies. But yeah, Henry said he bought one. He bought it five speed. Transmission? Maybe we can find one. We just need a diff. I saw some of the pictures. Okay, we're digging here, looking for a LSD for 2002. They said there might be a couple here. We should make a file which ones are not and which ones are. I know. Really? Does it actually look like it? Maybe someone already made a pile. Huh? Okay, Maybe see. someone made a pile. Yeah, I'll probably let you touch it. Because I go to the girl, she's in Sacramento. They're heavy too. Mm -hmm. What about you? Can you look up a picture of one? Hmm? Can you look up a picture? Take a picture? No, put, look it up, what it looks like. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. We cleaned up the underside a little bit and got it ready for paint. We popped open the diff and it's looking as good as we expected. Um, we're going to be ordering some gaskets for that and get that a little bit rebuilt and at least ready for it to go back in the car with some fresh fluid. And as you saw, we also put in those new bushings. They're looking great. Hopefully they don't squeak too much, but at least they'll be nice and solid. But that's going to be it for today. Um, we really appreciate you watching and we'll see you guys again next week.